Good morning and welcome to day 22 of May Vlogs. We're nearly there. <laughs> um, today is a work day for me. Jasper is at Childminder, Arthur is at school. Um, Tom is still around, he's just packing um, as he is off to Rome for the rest of the week, which is lovely for him. I'm quite jealous. Um, he is obviously going for work, not just a random holiday. Um, so yeah, today is a work day. I was meant to be dyeing up the film club today, but honestly, I just cannot face standing in the kitchen dyeing stripes today. So I've changed my days around a little bit. So I'm going to be dyeing up some more mini bundles and I also need to wind a lot of stripes as well. Um, I'm really not feeling it today. Um, thank you for all your lovely comments about how hard I work and, you know, all that kind of stuff. And yeah, at the moment, this is exceptional, obviously, with prepping for the shows. Um, normally I can kind of split things up a little bit and I can take a little bit more time over it. Although there is still a lot involved, um, in running a yarn dyeing business. Um, but yeah, there are days when I just do not want to do it. Today is one of those days where I just want to do other things. And to be honest, I kind of want to just clean my house, which sounds ridiculous. If you're, if my mother is watching this, <laughs> she will think I've gone insane. I hate cleaning. But my house is starting to feel like a bit of a tip and a bomb site. I haven't really had time for housework because all my time has been spent getting everything ready for the shows. Um, so yeah, it's kind of what I want to do today, but I can't. I need to crack on with um, getting some yarn dyed. So you know, if anyone wants to come over and clean my house while I do that, that'd be lovely. <laughs> really needs a good hoover. And I need to change arms because this arm is starting to ache. Um, yeah, and he's a good hoover and a good dust and everything like that. But, oh well, it, I can blitz it properly once the shows are done. <laughs> um, anyway, I better get on with a little bit of work. As I said, I've got stripes to wind and I've got mini bundles to dye. So my work day has just been interrupted and potentially my work week. Um, I've just had a call from the childminder. Jasper has just been sick. So I am on my way to go and pick him up. Um, and bring him home but that probably means that um, he won't be going to her Wednesday or Thursday this week um, so yeah not what I need just before a yarn show and also typical timing because Tom as I said is going away tonight um, and is going to be away till Saturday so I don't know it's like my kids know that Tom's going away so therefore they're going to get some sickness bug every time he goes away they get a sickness bug <laughs> oh well um, not much I can do about it fortunately I think I've just finished the kind of self striping for Leeds um, so I was going to take half to Leeds and half to Aberdeen and I think I've just finished winding all the self striping for Leeds um, so I guess that's not too bad because I've got the week before between Leeds and Aberdeen that if I've still got self striping to catch up on then I can do it I can do some in that week um, and the dyeing should still be okay because I can get the dyeing done in the evenings if I have to um, yeah so it could be a challenging week ahead I mean hopefully she said he's feeling a little bit hot so he's obviously got a bit of a temperature um, but hopefully it, the vomiting is just either just temperature related, in which case once I get his temperature down, um, he'll be okay, or it's just very, very short lived and he's not going to spend the next 24 to 48 hours throwing up all the time because that would be horrendous. And I don't deal well with vomit. I really don't. Are you happy to be home? Yeah? Are you feeling okay? Yeah, you seem to be alright, don't you? I may be behind on winding the stripes now, but at least I'm still on top of the dyeing. 
Right, well, the kids are in bed and seem to have gone quiet, which is amazing because it's actually before eight o'clock. <laughs> Um, Jazzy has been fine. He hasn't been sick again, just the once at the childminders. He didn't eat a lot of tea, but he's he's been fine. He's just knackered. Um, I don't know, you know, you never know, do you? Maybe he just ate his lunch too fast, or maybe it is just the result of this rash that he's got. I don't know. He seems fine in himself, though. Um, I'll keep him with me tomorrow, because I don't like sending him back. She, the childminder was happy to have him back, but... I kind of, I'd have just been a little bit worried about him all day if I send him back tomorrow, not knowing whether he was ill or quite what's going on. And it's not fair on her either. Um, so he'll stay with me tomorrow, which does mean it's kind of scuppered some of my plans for the week, but that's fine. I can work around it. I will rejig a few little bits and pieces and hopefully get back on track. Now, I did manage to dye up today um, two, two lots of two sort of batches i guess of um mini bundles um which is really good and i'm just going to pop on this evening um i was thinking about trying to catch up with the stripes but that's not going to happen because i really can't be bothered to be standing winding stripes all evening i need something a little bit easier where i can kind of sit down and do a little bit of knitting in between so i think i'm just going to dye up another batch of the mini bundles um, the June mini bundles, which are the purple ones, um, I want to be able to put them in the shop as well as take them to the shows. So I'm dying up a batch to put in the put up online. I can't talk tonight. Um, and I keep looking at myself and I keep looking at myself and not at the camera. <laughs> Sorry. Um, so yeah, I'm going to dye up a batch to actually put in the shop as well. Um, so I think I'm going to pop that on tonight and, um, yeah. That will be my evening, really. I've got a box of yarn to skein as well, so I'll do a little bit of skeining while I sit down and watch a film. Um, I've had a little look, and I think I'm going to watch Jane Eyre. I've not seen... It's the 2011, so it's a relatively new... I think it's four years... No, it's not... 2011, that's like... That's actually... That's like eight years old. <laughs> it's not new at all. Oh, God, time flies. Um, yeah, so there's a 2011 version of Jane Eyre, which I've not seen, so I think I might sit down and watch that and skein a little bit of yarn and then get a little bit of knitting or maybe some crochet, I'm not sure yet, um, done this afternoon, this evening even, not this afternoon, I don't know. Anyway, I'll see you all tomorrow.